Howdy all of you delicious people. Some different kind of modes than I tried today. Um, otherwise, just some interesting stuff kind of going on within this episode compared to some others. Um, so yeah, I had been able to make so much progress on this game that ultimately I had reasonably uh, been able to do so well that I got to a point that I've never gone to within this this series when I had played it previously. Um, normally, I think the highest I would get to is not there um, is rooftops. I think rooftops would be the highest ever that I would get to, and then normally I would just bounce back uh, from. Usually, I would get to uh, Shaiba Grove, and probably wouldn't get much higher than that um bizarrely um now i am at harwood county which i don't know what season that's from i don't know what setting that's from there's an actual setting of that i don't know where that's from but yeah i've never been in this environment before and so ultimately this goes well for me uh, more than likely you're probably going to see me lose a lot once you get to hardwood county uh, but it's kind of expected at some point. Uh, so reasonably, I have consistently still been using uh, Rito, uh, Zeo, Ranger Pink, and In Space Blue, and that seems to be working out for me. Uh, ultimately, it seems that uh, there's sometimes where I interchange Rito for uh, for Green Ranger, but a lot of times. Like, I still stick with the same kind of roster a lot. I very fewly change. Uh, here's some kind of slight tweaks and or changes of the roster so far. Uh, Goldar as a leader. Um, I have a in-space blue character that I could probably use at some point if I really wanted to. Because I think he is he's quasi-good. I've seen... Other people with him uh, used. Uh, yeah, still... Still kind of uh, chiming away at some characters. I have a, uh, a samurai... Uh, a samurai as a, a red samurai character as an assistant, which ultimately I kind of want to use... <laughs> I kind of want to use, but ultimately I'm leery if if I but I'm leery if I use her that ultimately I will like die consistently. I'm not sure. I'm not sure who to give up to have her on my team. Um, so because I'm not sure if I should give uh if I should have her be on my team and get rid of uh in space blue. Or, because I think more than likely, uh, Zeo Pink usually works every time, but there's sometimes where In Space Blue doesn't always work all the time, and then maybe um, Samurai Red would work better instead of In Space Blue. Uh, I say Power Rangers In Space Blue, but anyways. Um, yeah, today is a pretty decent day uh, for me. Uh, because not only while I was playing this, uh, I was playing this while also watching Mighty Morphin Power Rangers on Netflix. So simultaneously, I was like double, uh, double dutying uh, my Power Ranger duties to not only get a review out of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, so the first 25 episodes, which ultimately will be done on another channel called Grim Death Griffin. Um, me... Uh, talking about the first 25 episodes of season one of Money More from Power Rangers. But then eventually, uh, me kind of talking about those and, like, uh, I ultimately kind of talk about, like, the show in general, but then I kind of go through every single, uh, like, episode. Uh, some not all in exact, uh, because ultimately I talk about... I talk about the episodes, but then, like, I talk about, like, kind of some of them in general, not all in order. It is what it is. But anyways, so, here's my thing. Uh, with a lot of these, like, 
a lot of these things to unlock unlock a character man uh you just kind of get the same roll of the dice every single time no matter what level you're at no matter what you're doing it seems like no matter what you do every time that you go to unlock any number of these things to get more shards for a character it always seems to be the exact same characters every single time it's not like you're gonna get it it's not like the more levels that you go up into the better you're like oh my god this is an amazing pull that i got um because reasonably um you can probably assess that you're probably going to get a number of things you're probably going to either get a mighty more from power ranger from this now or you're probably going to get a movie ranger from this or you're probably going to get a uh, a random esh like thing of the day where it's like you either get turbo or maybe an in space character it's usually pretty random seemingly like to where you have an entire day of certain like characters sometimes it's like a wild force or something like that Woo yeah in space yeah that's what i thought uh that seems to be the 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 thing of the day where you get an in space character uh not that I'm not that I'm downplaying that um, that any of these are kind of like bad things, but it just seems like why is it that like you would think that when you're in this section, you would start to be getting a number of these characters that are on the sidelines here, but instead you were just like no like. There's not a drastic difference between rooftops and Hardwood County. It's not like all of a sudden you're going to get different pulls from any number of different uh, kind of things. So, like, what is the point in actually getting any different levels? You're not going to get better characters. Like, it seems like a, the only time that you're going to get really better characters is by having to... Uh, go in and, and do these offers here. Like, it seems like that's going to be the only way to get, like, actual different kinds of characters or characters that you would probably want more. Um, besides, like, once kind of when you get in the very beginning of the game, you can kind of get a pretty good random grab of, of good characters. But then after that, it's just kind of like, okay, well, man, it is a very slow bow to hoe to eventually just accumulate a lot of the same characters to then eventually at some point still accumulate a lot of like the lowered barred characters like i don't quite understand why um like why it doesn't feel much of a crazy roll of the dice when you play this a lot um i don't i don't get it uh, but it's not like I'm trying to say anything bad about the game. I'm just kind of a little confused where I'm like, man, I would love to get some really great pulls. But I haven't yet. <laughs> like, I desperately just want a really interesting pull. Uh, yeah, that was, that was fun for reasons. Okay, um... Like, but yeah, I just really want some indifferent pulls where I'm like, wow, like after like spending numerous hours waiting uh, to pull something from any number of these things, uh, because eventually you run out of crystals. So you're just waiting numerous hours for these things to unlock. Like, I swear, I had, a, I had to wait for one to be unlocked and I had to wait like an entire day and seemingly for one thing and i'm like i should be like getting like an amazing pull from this thing for how long i had to wait and then once i pulled it i'm like yeah i really didn't get anything that i was ooh wowing about um like that pull was just kind of like kind of uneventful really to me in my eyes so it was just kind of like eh. Like, it was just kind of, eh, it's just... So, yeah, let's go into the Megazord mode. 
kind of show people if they haven't seen this yet. Because uh, maybe they're not in the alliance. Just kind of randomly added myself on to some alliance. And at the end of the day, it's kind of been pretty productive. Uh, there's some kind of asking of shards that I would get. Or, or that I'd ask for. Landburn. All right. Come on. I'm the one on the on the right. Uh okay, I guess I can't. I guess there's only one way but but right or left. Come on. Slice and dice, slice and dice. Let's attack them cuz that's all we can do. Yeah, oh yeah. Looks like we're winning, bizarrely. Yeah, just. Oh, yeah, slice and dice, slice and dice. Put that sword in there. Bring that sword in, bad boy. Oh, we are taking him down. Oh, but he took me down, though. He told me. He told me how, how good times were. Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Don't do that. You're almost dead. Don't do that. Oh, yeah, you're dead. That actually, that match, not to be, not to belittle that guy, um, that match was actually pretty easy. Because <laughs> they're, like, I don't know, like, I think for a lot, wow, the Samurai Zord. Um, that would be great to eventually get some other swords. Uh, hopefully I would get the dragon sword, because that's what I want. Or any, just any, like, the Megazord, yeah, the original Meg. It's a great sword. I love, I love the original Megazord. Uh, there's nothing wrong with it. Ultimately, I think, uh, I like it much more some, than some other swords. Some other swords are really goofy. Some other Mega Megazords. I I love I loved original Tommy. I loved original Tommy. L original Green Ranger Tommy. Everything about that guy, everything about that cat. I was like, god, this guy is wearing a uh shield on his chest and like I loved to I don't I don't care much for White Tiger Tommy. Because ultimately like Tommy just became a leader once uh, once uh Jason left. But yeah, let's get into some battles. But yeah, so and re oh, I forgot to to mention about the the cosmetic stuff about like the shield of Tommy's shield in the in the Mighty Morphin Power Ranger review. But I'm not gonna redo that over just to talk about cosmetic stuff. Um. But yeah, so. Oh crap. This is gonna be tough. I gotta work on that timing of, of trying to get that move in there where they uh will the will there where they will stupidly uh attack me and then I'll take advantage of that. I know I haven't gotten that timing done quite correctly yet. There we go. That was done correctly. Come on, no, 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 back away. Back away, not today, Mr. Man, sir. Oh, come on, let me just win. Let me just beat you. Because I need to desperately win every little thing here. No, don't do that. Some weird lag is going on at the end of this match. No, oh, whatever that was. Some weird lag going on at the end there. But anyways, so yeah, there's some... Uh, like, I'm, I'm not... 
I'm not trying to sound like I want to progress and I want to progress now. Um, ultimately, I'm just kind of, I'm having a lot of days. I'm having just a lot of fun. Um, and I know a lot of people would ultimately just stubbornly say at some point, like, dude, if you want to get certain characters, just buy them. Uh, which ultimately I can't do anyways if I wanted to. But, um, but yeah, it's like, but when looking at it, like, you want the rarer characters. You don't want to just be sidelined and saddlebagged with just going into just... That's where I was thinking, like, for some of the, uh... Like, some of the missions, you would think they would be better off. Like, some of the side missions, you would think would be better off. If instead of just giving you some random like guessing thing where you could get any number of shards which is probably just the same old shards it's like hey here's more of the movie characters or here's more of the uh characters that you probably don't care about instead it would just be like oh hey here's the here's this like special event character or hey do you want more shards of so-and-so person then do this side mission Come on, I've beaten this this person before, because this person looks familiar. I don't remember the name, but ah uh, yeah, here we go, here we go, here we go. Now we're rolling, now we're rolling, dying but rolling. Oh come on, yeah, here we go, here we go. Now we're rolling. Oh, uh, come on. Let, let me just get some hits in. You want you want, you want to let me get some hits? Just a little couple of hits here and there, you know? Oh. People thought I was dying, right? Like, dude, he's going to die in this. He's going to die in this fight. But yeah, so. I think that character every single time that's one of those where like if you get really close up to that team basically negates everything because reasonably like you get really close and then you just like strike repetitively and goes down every single time like i don't know if that person like doesn't like the 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 short game uh, and I don't even know if it's that same team every time. It could just be those characters. Like, they're, it must be just that greatest weakness of that team is just... Because um, I don't remember if the, the, who the the assists were, because um, it could be different assist characters. It could just be a, a person that's probably newer-ish newer, newer -ish to the game. Um, but yeah, so... I'm ultimately thinking about trading up for, for Tommy. Cause, plus, I also have to kind of start doing different teams. Because ultimately, everybody's going to be like, Yeah, I'm getting sick of him using like the same characters. Which I can understand. But it's just... When you have a hot streak going on... <laughs> what, do you want to just blow that hot streak? When you actually are successful with certain portions of characters, you want to just blow everything? Just because... You, like, you're winning, and then you're just like, well, no, how about I change things up? Uh, just to change things up. And then plus, like, I don't feel that I've made enough progress on, on uh, like, an overall, like, ooh, this is a character I desperately want to, to play. Um, there isn't a character that's like that yet that I have where I'm like, Oh man, I desperately want to play it. No, I just like keep going back to either. Um, oh, I don't have enough gold for that. Um, I keep going back to either Tommy or uh, Rito and I don't have any assist characters that I think are really good enough. Uh, but ultimately I'm sure there's a lot of people that would probably tell me, Oh Yeah. Like, use this character. They're actually really good. 
or get this character up to a better standings or this and that. So I think let's go. No, uh, no, let's not do that. Uh, I think we're going to, we're going to, yeah, we're going to use her. We're going to use her in that, in that, and then we're going to, so we're going to change it up slightly. Ever so slightly. Mm. I I don't like any of these leaders. Because I I'm still afraid of using Zed because I don't think I can use Zed all that well. Uh Goldar might be fun. Even though I don't think he's gonna be that good of a he's not gonna be that productive. Um Uh, I could see, I know the Black Ranger from, uh, from Wild Force is pretty good. I would like to see what Pink, uh, Ranger does from, I think that's Lost Galaxy. Is, is this Lost Galaxy? Where, where is she from? Yeah, Lost Galaxy. Dang! I am actually getting pretty good in remembering, like, who I think these characters are from, from certain seasons. Uh, and yeah, I realize probably a lot of these, a lot of people will say, hey man, like, why aren't you upgrading a lot of the stats on certain things? It's probably just because if I don't use a character, I don't care to beef them up. Because um, ultimately I realize their value and I just don't just beef every character up just to do so which I know is a stupid move. Um, like, I barely have... Like, I kind of have beefed up my Megazord, but, like, I'm not a person that, has, that wants to go in and beef up every little thing of a character. Like, I just want to go in, play it, and then if I lose, I lose. If I win, I win. Um... All right. Yeah, so we're going to go in and use this character. I want to see if he does well. I don't think he will. Because I think if anything, like, a lot of people, this is a lot of people's, like, go-to was to use this character as a leader. So I think everybody has probably figured out a way to stop him at some point. Um, but a lot of times nobody, um, uh, like you would have thought that like everybody, uh, would be using Rito right now, but maybe not everybody, uh, maybe no one, uh, knows, knows how good Rito is or reasonably, uh, nobody, uh, wants to use him, but man, is he a Yeah, I don't know why it is. Uh, the series tends to, like, I think it's maybe, like, the Wi-Fi connection to this whole thing. But, yeah, like, I get cutouts so many times with, uh, you could probably see it some of the episodes where, like, if you watch to the very end, which probably maybe not a lot of people do, but that's completely fine. Um, yeah, there's sometimes where it, like, cuts off at the very end of me saying something. And then I'm like, you know what? Like, I spent... Like thirty some odd minutes talking this video. I think I'm, I'm. I think I'll just be done. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna try to like end the the video or whatever. Like I'll just kind of just be like, you know what? I'm just kind of like fine with just being done. Like I'm I'm kind of fine um, with kind of man. Like I have to figure out how to use uh, that samurai girl. Oh my god! I have to figure out. I have to refigure out all these characters. It's like starting from scratch all over again. Oh my god, it's starting from scratch. Because I haven't used this character in such a long time. It's been such a long... It's been such a long road. It's such a long journey. I'm so used to also using Brito a lot. Uh... Oh, uh, yeah. Mmm, yeah. Just yeah. God, I have to, 
I have to figure this all out again. Oh my god. Uh, that was awful. Yeah, you better be angry because that was awful. Rightfully so. That's because I didn't know any of the characters. I didn't know how to use them. Uh, let's go into another fight. I only, I know I only fought as a Megazord one more time. I think I'm going to do that one more time. Uh, probably fight a Megazord again. Because I think everybody, like, I don't think nobody gets really all that high in a lot of those Megazords. Because basically, um, everybody is still at normal re Megazord. Nobody else, I guess probably I'm only... Uh, fighting everybody through a certain like level, and plus I don't have a lot of I don't have a lot of wins in my my belt. So yeah, um, I'm probably gonna be stuck fighting uh, normal Megazords a lot, so it's gonna be confusing until I win a lot more. Okay, so fig. Oh god. Figure out how to how to do this. Figure out how to use this character again. There we go. Somewhat, maybe a little bit. Now that it's still awful. Still trying to figure this character out. Uh, do that. Do that. Oh come on, you. God, I'm still. Uh. You know what I don't like the I would love distant uh, assistance I don't want assistance where I have to get way up close to somebody so I don't know how well uh, this samurai character is gonna go down with me to use come on Come on, come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Are you just gonna... Is it gonna be all day with this? Oh, uh, what? Oh, yeah. What? Oh, oh, uh, oh, uh, no. Oh, no, yeah. Oh, I just kicked him to death. I don't think I can use these characters. Um, I could probably say that I could use uh, Black Ranger from Wild Force really good before. I don't think I can use him now. I am definitely out of my league with that character. Because uh, I used to use him all the time. And I would, like, he's a character that you very much needed to master. And I think I did that at some point. But now, he's not that easy. <laughs> he is not that easy for me to figure out and for me to beneficially use. And then, these assisted characters, uh, the Red Samurai, I can't figure out how to use her yet. Um... Like, I, I I, would rather much use distant characters than uh, characters that are close up. I would rather ra use... Uh, I'd rather use White Ranger Tommy. <laughs> uh, let's go... Let's go to that old standby. Let's have uh, Blue Ranger from uh, Dino Charge. It's kind of old standby. Uh, okay, I want to use a different. Uh, let's use let's use Purple Dino Charge. She seems like a fun character. Let's use her. 
celery I can kind of mix in uh... I've, I've seen her use you can like you can tell that I've I've seen her use so let's let's do this team kind of see where this team is at this is gonna be goofy um because I don't know this leader at all like how to use her because that's the thing you could watch people use her but it's different when you're actually in the in the captain's chair so to speak when you're basically when you're the one playing this character it's really goofy Okay, that's interesting. Okay. So far, not so bad. So far, quasi liking this character. This uh, pink ranger is getting way too close to me. I want to kick her off to the side or justifiably get rid of her somehow where she is not right up in my grill all the time. But since I can't do that, I'm just going to keep blasting away at her, telling her to go away because I like characters that aren't right up in my face. But dude, I have plenty of health. Please try to uh, kick and or punch me because I am just going to do this and this. Goodbye. Wow. Wouldn't you know? <laughs> just a leader that you just randomly use. Actually, she's actually pretty good. Uh, but Rito, if you don't have Rito, uh, he's worth, uh, if you could buy him, he's worth a purchase. Uh, if you buy characters, Rito is worth a buy, Rito is worth a use. Uh, if you haven't been using him, I think you're sleeping on him. Um, I love using Rito. He is so, like, his, like, for... A lot of newer characters, I would, I would for not a lot of newer players, I would suggest him. Uh, you can do really well, um, and he's an easy character to figure out. Um, reasonably, uh, the character that I just used actually was was like really fun. Um, so yeah, I'll probably. Uh, I'll probably intermittently be using her because I thought her I thought she was like really uh, a good time good prices even though she was like free for me to get through random means but yeah let's do another Megazord battle because I'm sure I'm gonna probably lose this second one uh, just because I won this other one um like I think when I first did this I was losing a lot because I'm like I don't know what's going on here. Uh, but then I was like, all of a sudden, like, you know what? Like, how about I do this? And then it all of a sudden started to work. I'm fighting Ryan. Ryan. Yeah, because I started to realize that it seems like nobody is... Everybody's going for the big moves. And that's the problem. Is everybody's going with the big moves... And they're really not realizing that those big moves take a long time to do. <laughs> that is the problem. Come on, come on. God, you too, you wanna do big moves. That's the problem there, bucko, is you want to do all the big moves, but you're not realizing that that's going to cost you in the end. Ah, oh, that was cool. God, again, he's killing me, though. Yeah, he's killing me. 
that's a problem. Like, people should be thinking about this as a marathon, not a sprint. When it comes to, to the Megazord battles, everybody's just like, yeah, I'm going to get in there and try to, like, bash the crap out of this character. No! Just get little hits and then back away. Get little hits and then back away. That should be your bread and butter when it comes to this thing. And everybody wants to do the big, uh, huge power moves and this and that. And the problem with those is, is those attacks take too long to do. So yeah, you can do those. You can do those attacks all you want. But uh, ultimately, somebody's just going to back away from you. And it's going to be a waste of time for you to try to do all those moves. And then you're just going to blow energy and just waste time. I, want, I like doing the smaller attack moves um, just because I think they, to me, I think uh, they, like, I think they work better. I think a lot of people, like, are just kind of like, whoa, he's doing attack moves? Why, why doesn't he want to throw out a sword and, and slice and dice me? Come on, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you, yeah, you wanted to do that. Oh, I gotcha. I gotcha. All right. Let's do this then. I'll do the, the big moves. Because that's what you want. Obviously. And then I'll kick you. I'll kick you when you're down. Basically. Let's get it rage. I don't like using rage. It's stupid. Uh... <laughs> Let's be in the rage. Let's rage against the machine here. I'm going to do a little bit of that. Oh, uh, you don't want me to use my sword move? Okay, all right. I got a little hit on you, buddy. Oh, uh, God, you, you people and your slice and dice moves. Oh, well, look at that. I can do the same thing. Oh, look at this. Oh, look, look at me. Look at me go. <laughs> just, the guy just stood there and let me hit him. It was good. He's like, you know what? I'm going to die. I'll let him beat me. Generous people, let me win. Could have backed away. Man, Megazords, though, are the hardest to move. Like when you're when you're toggling these things and trying to just back away or you're trying to get like anywhere, it's such a, a clunky business. Like when you when you get into regular battles, uh how long am I recording for? 14 minutes. Okay, we're gonna wrap this up here pretty soon. Um I apologize if it feels like every episode I don't get enough done around showcase a lot of stuff. More than likely, probably a bulk of every episode is just me showcasing progress. Um, but yeah, or me just talking like like I know everything about this game. Um, but yeah, I'm just kind of like, this is how I play it. And ultimately, a lot of people will probably learn from that. And then they'll probably like... Yeah, this is how he plays it. So when I see his name pop up on somewhere, I'm coming for him. I, I don't care. Because ultimately, that's the thing. Like, uh, strategies that I come with, come up with, eventually people, as more and more that I, longer that I play this, are eventually going to figure this out anyways. And then the uh, moves that I think are the best, I'm going to have to relearn everything from scratch anyways. So... If I'm saying, everybody, be Rito right now, and and every... Because clearly, this guy has a strat going. <laughs> this guy, this guy watches my videos. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh. This is so weird to be playing against him. Oh... Uh... This is gonna, this is gonna blow up in my face. How soon is it gonna blow up in my face?
Come on, come on, come on. Oh, crap. Yeah, I knew it. I knew that was coming. Okay, I have to make it so he does not get all up in my grill. All up in my business. Somebody's been watching my videos. Knowing how I work. Knowing how I do things. As if, like, yeah, he's a fan. He's a big fan. Dang it! Uh, I knew this was going to take me on a road trip. Going downtown. Oh, no. You lose. I was like, yeah, me going up against Rito, I'm going to get killed. Sure, far enough, that's what happens. I want to play, I haven't played yet, Rito versus Rito to see. All right, before I was cut off again, I was like, you know what? It would be great if uh, I could see what would happen between a Rito versus Rito thing. Because uh, ultimately I was going to go right into a battle, but then I realized I can open one of these bad boys. One of these one of these free freebies. Please give me something great, please, for the for the love of, of all that's holy. I don't, I don't, just, just... Can I please, for the love of God, get some, like, man, I just, I just want to progress. I, I don't want to get the same shards for the same characters over and over and over again. Um, I, I just, like, I was like, you know what, I was saying, like, you know what, I'm probably going to get a shard of Mighty Morphin or probably the movie and like cuz those seem to be the only two god can i can i get some like samurai characters could i get some more in space characters besides just maybe the blue character uh could i get some more turbo characters please not even like like i'm not saying that i want every single tommy character and that i want every single sixth ranger that you have in the arsenal that i want to just be like a power ranger legacy war god that just is like looking over every single player and is like ha look at the unique character i have <laughs> no that's not what i'm saying like, I don't want to have the most, like, special and or unique experience to where I'm getting, like, the best characters and no one else is. Um, I'm saying, hey, if I'm going to get a Gold Ranger, Zeo, whatever, then everybody else should be getting the same. Because um, that's the thing. Everybody's experience is really different. Like, drastically different. I, I did a phone uh, variation of this game, and I actually probably got better characters vice versa more than likely there might just be one day uh where i'll showcase like what's going on with my phone version uh if ultimately i look into that and it's the same version of because i ultimately uh deleted the app because i needed to have storage upon it so uh if ultimately it is where i left off at then i'll show people uh the the other variation the phone variation um because yeah good god I i'm not afraid of uh of of this character because i don't know him that well but the tommy assist and the rita i'm a little afraid of because i've only seen rita been used once Come on. Come on. Don't. Oh, yeah. He's from Time Force. The stupid show. Well, I don't know. There might be some Time Force fans in here. I don't, I don't want to badmouth a show, even though it's probably, like, hands down, just the most relevant show. Uh, but I guess that also might be Lightspeed Rescue, because... 
I reviewed like the first twenty episodes of Lightspeed Rescue, and no one cared. Everybody's like, I don't care about Lightspeed Rescue. Why are you reviewing Lightspeed Rescue? No, that was like a show no one cared about because it wasn't a extremely relevant show. Um, yeah. All right. Uh, going out on a whimper. Well, that guy, like, clearly you could see that that guy had, like, unique, uh, like, uh, power coins and so like that. that guy probably paid his way. That guy probably opened up his wallet. Probably get Rita Repulsa and Tommy as an assist. He probably opened up his big fat wallet. Probably did. Probably opened up his big fat fat, juicy, succulent wallet and bought all his way through all those characters, which is completely okay. Um, but man, why is he fighting me? He should be on the upper echelon, so just beating everybody. So yeah, uh, I'm going to get out of here. So, uh, yeah, um, it's a slow, it's a slow burn um, through this game. Um that I've learned that, uh, let me know if people's experience are drastically different. Uh, let me know if everybody's getting like extremely rare characters that they're not having to go through like these, uh, special offers like these things. If everybody's just getting unique pulls and I'm just like the, the guy at the end of a crappy totem pole of just, no, yeah, I'm not getting like, I'm getting some rares every once in a while and this and that, and it doesn't have to be from any special event. Um, yeah, desperately, God, uh, again, I would love to just do like an ad all day to just get more crystals. Um, I don't want to do, I don't want to go into another game uh, just to get crystals for this game. I just don't. That is the one thing I don't want to do. I'll watch ads spamily all the live long to get like a ton of crystals, but I don't want to go and physically go into another game to get crystals for this game. Plus, none of the games that were offered for free crystals are really all that anything that I want to play. Um, ultimately, they should be advertising like onto this like them play them like other power ranger games but i guess they don't want to try to steal anybody's thunder uh lord draken ultimate yeah i know lord draken from uh shattered grid i haven't read any of the books but i kind of uh have heard a thing or two about him um manga defender where is manga defender from Oh, Lost Galaxy, that's why. <laughs> Lost Galaxy. Uh, Lost Galaxy and Time Force. They don't get enough love from looking at it. They're not good shows. <laughs> Luckily, I have this character. Luckily, I have him. I got him bizarrely earlier on in the game. Uh, sadly enough, uh, it's probably like, well... Act, well, uh, yeah, they're they're giving up a regular Tommy as well in this offer, um, but nothing else really all that good beyond that. Well, I don't know. You could probably get maybe some decent other characters. Uh, you would think that like they would just be like shelling out like a Tommy deal. Like you would think that. Especially because everybody loves Jason David Frank. You would think that they would do like a Jason David Frank offer where like it's like, hey, you would get like 10 shards of Zeo Tommy, White Ranger Tommy, Green Ranger Tommy, Dino Thunder, even maybe Turbo, even though technically Tommy gave up uh, Turbo to give to TJ. Um, still, he's still Turbo Tommy, I guess. Uh, so you can make an offer for that, but anyways. Um, 
I don't know why I go into these offers. I either don't have resources for them or ultimately I'm like I'm not going to spend money for any of these characters because I don't have money to spend. Um, but in the end, I probably wouldn't spend on any of these things, even if I did have the money. Um, just because I think I should be able to have like a free way um, to be able to get these characters regardless, but it doesn't really seem that way. Because, yeah, um, I don't know what it is. Like, I don't know which, uh, like, which one of these things would, like, unlock, like, some actually really good pulls. Uh, so yeah, more than likely it's probably just like, oh yeah, buy one of these, buy one of these, they're really good, or buy like some kind of absurd, um, pack of some kind, because that's the only way you'll be able to get good characters. If everyone is kind of saying that, is that, like, if that is really overall, like, just forcibly get a lot of crystals and then buy these special offers to get good characters if that's the only way to get good characters i think that that is wrong i think that that is just like that really just sucks so what if you're just a free to play player that like has every resource under the world because you just play this game every single day for like eight hours and you play it really well and whatever, but you never have really gotten to unlock any real severely rare characters that were like Whamadon like finds. Um, because ultimately, like, yeah, you couldn't get enough crystals, you couldn't get a. So basically, like, if you have like a catch them all like mentality, which I do, which I'd like to eventually just collect everything. Um, and like, it's like, to me, it's not like I want to be better than everybody else. I just want to collect all the, the characters. Cause recently, like when you watch all these shows, you start to invest in every little character. So basically I'm not saying that I want to just like, yeah, I want the best character. I want the sixth ranger of everything. No, I just want to collect everything. And I feel that, um, I feel like I'm just getting the run of the same things over and over and over again. Like, as if, like, basically there isn't much of, like, a random chance going on. Or, like, again, when you get through certain levels, you're like, uh, new warriors discovered. I'm like, well, when looking at any number of these, like, what is the difference between these and this wrong way down here? <laughs> I am still getting stuff from way down here. <laughs> All of this stuff I'm still getting from here. This makes no sense. Why am I still getting characters from all the way down here when I should be getting through pulls where I am? I never got any any number of these characters. Maybe the, the Turbo Pink... Uh, I think I had to buy the Lost Galaxy character. I bought, like, one little thing of the Lost Galaxy character. Um, maybe Dino Ranger Blue and Goldar, and maybe Zed. Uh, maybe maybe some of these um, Mighty Morphin characters, and then maybe the Dino Charge characters I had gotten uh from here maybe the the red uh this uh, the samurai character maybe these characters i had gotten some the ones that are here i gotten some of these but yeah like recently um it was just like straight up like a lot of these i don't think i ever really got from here <laughs> from whenever i would like i think uh, 
like yeah it's really weird i think i would probably get stuff from from this level when i was up here which is weird So does the does the game not exactly understand where which rung you're at? Is that the thing? Is that the problem? Cause that's what I'm understanding now. Is it I don't think it understands which actual level you're on and which and which characters you should actually be getting. Because I think for the longest time I'm getting characters from other rungs and other levels, which <laughs> Like, you would think that I would all of a sudden start to be getting, oh, okay, well, I am here uh, at uh, this place. So, uh, shouldn't I start be popping off some titanium character or this and that? No, I'm kidding. Uh, hey, how about you get some, uh, some Lost Galaxy pink? Hey, how about that? I'm not even getting Alpha. Can I get Alpha? Alpha is actually a pretty decent character. I am scared of Alpha. Could I get uh, the... Uh, I keep calling him Robo Ranger, but that's not who he is from uh, Samurai. Um, this guy here, can I get Can I get him? Because... <laughs> could I get him an assist or leader? Um, because I want him... Uh, should I just stay at rooftops? Should I go backwards and go to rooftops? So that way I can try to collect the, that character? because Or Tommy? <laughs> so, I should try to do worse so I can see if I can get Tommy or not. Then again, I probably will never get Tommy in... <laughs> I don't know. Um, let me know what your experience is. Uh, reasonably, yeah. You would think that New Warriors to Discover would mean, like, yeah, you would start be seeing a change in uh, quite frequently. Whenever you go from level to level, you would start to see a change. I've still been getting the same pulls through, uh, but maybe... That might just be the gap of the uh, rewards you're getting from beating every level, like the three hour, uh, like the three hour uh, pool things, of the um, like these, like these uh, two to three hour pool things. That might just determine like what you're getting. So it might just be like, oh, from only these, you're only be getting gonna be getting these certain characters. Okay, from from this one, uh, from this one, you're gonna be getting this certain characters and this and that. So, so what is the point of saying that that you're gonna get uh, that you feel like you're going to be supposedly guaranteed these characters if, when all actuality, when you're going to be pulling uh, bub kiss characters from this? Um, Again, this is not me complaining, like, ultimately, like, I'm just, I'm just trying to figure things out. Um, trying to figure out, like, how to most beneficially, like, go about things. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to figure out why I've consistently getting, like, pulls of just the same uh, things over and over. I don't know. When I've called it out where it's like, yeah, I'm going to get a Mighty Morphin Power Ranger today. <laughs> and then, sure, fire enough. Uh, when I pull something, is like, Mighty Morphin Power I'm like, okay, sure. Um, so I'm assuming probably with the freebie ones, you'll probably get the same. So every one of these pull things, you kind of get the same things over and over, regardless if you, like, whatever level you're at. So how are you going to get new characters? Would the new characters, would the new warriors be from these corrupt zones? I'm trying to figure out where to where to get different characters. I'm trying to figure out where where is the best way, besides uh, supposedly buying or I wouldn't buy. 
figuring out how to how how to get freely crystals to like so is the crystal events the only way to get characters i would assume get them eventually at some point because what other way would there be to ultimately get a variety going i don't know i don't i don't think i don't think the pools are variety enough and that's uh the one thing that i have to say to end this episode so i'm gonna get out of here uh i don't want to i don't want to seem like i'm complaining every episode um i'm just trying to like be uh a person that is trying to figure out what's like all going on per episode to episode but i'm gonna get out of here bye everybody bye everybody